Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Today I want to talk about Mudeng's business Mudeng business has been established since 1987 in the state of Kedah The business is one of the small and medium enterprises in Malaysia that produce food products The business developed with a step up capital of 10,000 ringgit Malaysia and was managed efficiently and efficiently until Mudin's business achieved an increase in asset to 300,000. In March 2019, business of Mudin Zakaria have changed to Mudin. Zakaria Food Industries Sendirian Berhad Tuan Haji Zakaria bin Arsha was given the title of Tok Mudin He was born on 9 January 1934 at Kampung Jelutong Mungkin Torbiah Pendang Kedah Starting with the traditional medicines business on a small scale in the village The venture had to do the hard work the business was assisted by his son named Encik Syarani bin Zakaria who is now in charge of managing the company. In the early 20, Haji Syarani has interrupted the business world with the guidance of his father. Okay, vision and mission. The vision of the Mudeng company is that it will produce high quality and halal products for domestic and foreign market. Mudeng's second vision is that their company will continue to contri contribute to the growth of the Bumi Putra economy in Malaysia. The first mission of the Mudeng company is to remain commitment to building the company's brand and adding value to meet consumers' expectation. Mudeng's second mission is to provide high quality customer satisfaction with high quality product at effort affordable price. Mudin's third mission is that their company will continue to be committed to leading the Malaysian food industry. The last mission is that Mudin will continue to be creative, innovative, competitive and viable to move toward the best, fast and easy company by 2020 mission. Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh And hi everyone Okay, my name is Muhammad Fikri Nabil bin Syafi'i And my metric card number is H19B0293 And for my section, I will describe about the roadmap Or the location of the Muslim Zakaria food industry Okay, let's go if we see at the pictures above, the Mudim Zakaria food industries are located at the Pendang and state of Kedah. They are located are connect with the main road of Jalan Pendang dash Tanah Merah. And the address is number 26 Kampung Jelutong MK 06700 Pendang Kedah. And the location is inside the area of the village and it's also very strategic and easy to find the location. It's also usually the local people to get there to get the product from Zakaria Food Industry. And if if they didn't find the location, they can use the application like Swiss or Google Maps to easily find the location. Now we will describe about the organizational chart of the company. The first level of the organization chart is managing director and under the managing director there are several other positions such as marketing director, HR director, chief operating officer, 
customer care manager and head of finance. They are marketing executive under the supervision of marketing director while HR director have secretaries, requirement manager and the training manager under them. The company also have IT executive and call center manager who work with the customer care manager. For the head of finance also have executive purchasing worker and operation center under their supervision. And the lastly, for the chief operating officer, they have chief manager and the crew members of company. Okay, and okay, that's all about the organizational chart of the Mudim Zakaria Food Industries. And now we will describe about the marketing strategy. When you feel it's hopeless, first when you think that segmentation. You means to divide the market base into parts or segments which are definable, accessible, actionable, and profitable and have a true potential. The modern Zakaria food industries are famous among the others local products, so they was choose the best time to market their products like the supermarket and the hypermarket. An example of the hypermarket that they use for the market their product are like the Ecosin, Esco, and Aeon. Second, they also use the Ecosin and the small grocery smart to market their product to the value like the Ecosin Bazaar. criteria of the product. Only the industry have their own uniqueness and best in the to make their soy sauce taste delicious. And they also use the fresh ingredients ingredients to make their product is more suitable for all the people. Special soy sauce 415 gram with 11 ringgit and 90 cent. So it's suitable because the price is not too expensive and not too not cheap at all. For the third point is place. Mudim Zakaria was started the business in Kedah since 1987. On 2nd March of 2019, Modim's products are available at ASEAN Mall, Patani, Thailand. They also plan to open up a warehouse in Gopeng Perak and Joho for the new branch. For the last point is promotion. Modim Zakaria Food Industries and Abhai think like, not, like other entrepreneurs. They use the social media as medium to separate the information for the customer. They also have accounts such as Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube.
for the customer reference. The customer also can find this product on Modem website and Shopee. They also can buy it via online. This is because nowadays people have the technology and it's always, it's always on our hand. So that's all from me. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Nurul Afika Fadila binti Muhammad Yusuf. I will present about SWOT analysis Modem and Zakaria Food Industry. Strength Sell directly to consumer Keep cost below competitor cost Offer variety of high quality product at affordable price in various size according to the needs of user Weakness Less attractive packaging can cause modern product cannot survive long on the market Lack of product variety Modern only produce soy sauce Kitchen and Ranger Mudin does not have many workers Opportunity Mudin choose London, United Kingdom and Arab Saudi because more purchasing power from customer and business in that country Superior taste to suit variety of consumer taste and advance in PKG will feature Mudin with more optimistic image of modern among competitors. Trade as a produce of soy sauce, kicha and vinegar. There are many competitors producing the same product such as Jalin and Kipas Udan. Unsustainable price increased by supplier may increase the cost of product, hence it increased the price and cost loss of cons Customer, new campaign launched by competitor can cause loss of customer because they might want to try new product. For my part, I will explain about budgeting plan. Budgeting plan is referred to the process by which a business estimates its finances for a future period and plans its operation accordingly. In developing a corporate budget. A business usually start with a project plan, then determine the amount of time, goals and cost of the project. Once your business is operation, it is essential to plan and tightly manage its financial performance. Create a budget process is the most effective way to keep your business and its finance on track. They restructure the budgeting plan restructure and observe the budgeting plan as yet to earn income and reduce the expenses to avoid bankrupt. Their profit shows the defined curve to keep the company operating. The revenue statement show Moodin Food Industries and Yamber Hunt has a stable company. They are also success in controlling the financial flow in their company. Budgeting plan is important for a company because since budgeting allows you to plan your expenses for company money, it ensures that your company will always have enough money for what you need and things that are important to your company. Following a budget a spending plan will also keep you out of debt or help you solve the problem if you are in debt. Conclusion Modern Zakaria Food Industry is a great company in managing their productivity. Modern Zakaria Food Industry is the largest company in the world according to the number of product and market share it has. The Modern Zakaria Food Industry it also has average customer who made their product popular abroad and many a customer use their product like soy sauce and vinegar. The main goal of the Modern Zakaria food industry is to achieve better market share and profitability worldwide.